fundamental, in my view, to an understanding of DevOps is the collapsing of feedback. So if you consider all of the different subsystems and people and stakeholders and processes that exist in organizations that want to try and produce something, what DevOps is about is making the feedback between the different requirements and the different perspectives and the different skills and knowledge of those different people as effective and as fast and as seamless as possible. That's at its core what DevOps is. Now, if you consider how to make that happen in a large company, or frankly, how to make that happen in a small company, there are certain cultural and behavioral um, issues that need to be addressed. And so, you know, examples of these might be the idea of uh, a blameless post-mortem. So when there are problems that happen uh, in an organization, whether it be related to a particular incident that happens in the system, or whether it may be something to do with people not getting on. There are blameless postmortems run in most organizations that have really fully inculcated this idea of DevOps as an operating principle. And so, you know, there are certainly organizational things that you have to do. Similarly, you also need, as I said earlier, for people to understand the role that they play with an end product. It's extremely difficult for somebody to believe in the, the role and respect the role that everybody has to play in a particular product development process if the only part of that product development process that they can see and understand is their own. Because if all you can see is, well, here's my server and this is what I look like and someone else comes over and she happens to say to you, well, you need to do that. Well, look, this is my world. I look after the server. You go do what you do. Whereas alternatively, in a DevOps-oriented organization where you are looking at product-oriented teams, where you're looking at the person who runs the server is very, very clear in his or her mind that the reason for being of that set of compute power is to answer and to provide the following services to a customer over there. And that is an absolutely critical difference. And if organizations are not able to at least begin to start developing that awareness, it's extremely difficult to, to develop that sense of accountability for the end product, also the sense of blamelessness and um, just wanting to identify how to improve the process that produces those products rather than protect your own little piece of piece of the pie.